Welcome to Ortho Eval Pal, where we help you build confidence in your orthopedic evaluation and management skills. Hey there, this is Paul from Ortho Eval Pal, and I have Sue with me today. And I want to thank Sue for allowing us to look at your knees and uh, to do a little demonstration here. So today I want to talk about knee arthritis. Now Sue doesn't have all the classic signs, but she has some really severe arthritis. So at rest, do you have a lot of pain? No, I don't. You don't. Now, what really hurts the most? Skiing. Skiing. And you like to downhill ski a lot. I love to downhill. And I remember last year you were miserable yeah. all season. And so this is kind of an unusual presentation. Sue has more pain with her functional activities. She likes to stay really active. But you'll see that she really has pretty good function in her knees, but with a lot of um, abnormality. And uh, you'll, you'll see in just a second. So a couple things. Number one, she has you know severe pain when she's doing activity. She's used to be a big runner and has stopped doing that because of pain. She's taken up biking, um, and that's a little better. Oh, you can yes. stay kind of yes. stay in shape with that. Yes. Um, and so she's had to really limit her quality of life for this. She's going to be undergoing to two total knee replacements really soon. And um, so I just wanted to show you some of the classic signs. Now I'm going to have you stand up for me, Sue, if you would, for a second. And as you'll see, her knees are relatively straight, okay? And even has a little valgus. This is extremely, extremely rare with people with arthritis. Usually they have bowed legs or genuverum, okay? So, Sue, so I'm going to have you lie right down on the table. And I want to show you, I want to demonstrate your motion. The other thing that you'll notice is she extends her knee very well. And go ahead and bend your knee, okay? And really, she, she has some limitation here. Um, but it's not that bad for somebody who has arthritis. Let's bend the other one, okay? And she's pretty arthritic on both. So let's straighten this one out. Now what I want you to do is I'll have you come right around here. One of the other classic signs of, of knee arthritis is that the kneecap is extremely large for her knee, okay? So it's really spurred out and a lot wider than most kneecaps. She has a lot of bony spurring, so let's bend this knee a little bit. And you'll notice over here she has some spurring medially laterally. Um, let's bring it down. You'll also notice that she has an effusion in the knee. Right over here. Take a peek at that. I'll try to get out of the light. All right, and she has the same thing on the other side. Notice the bony deformity on this kneecap. Okay, look how wide it is. How tall are you? Five one. She's five one, and how much do you weigh? 115 pounds. Her kneecaps should not be that big. Um, so this is bony spurring around the ridges. The femur and tibia are spurring also. Um, and, um, and you can see where that's affected her. Now she said she used to have difficulty straightening her legs out, but she used to also have a lot more swelling and that would cause that flexion position. Um, so classic knee arthritis. She's going to have two total knee replacements and um, I'm sure she's going to do excellent because her activity level is um, really, really high and uh, she really wants to stay active. So uh, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, go to www.orthoevalpal.com. Thanks. We hope you've enjoyed this video and for more awesome content, go to orthoevalpal.com. Can't wait to see you there.